So a treasury function traditionally would be looking at how market risk is managed on one side and how the bank should be aware of what the market forces are that determine the risks on its balance sheet and actually how you manage that risk. That's one aspect of it. And the second thing would be on the liquidity side. How, how is it that you maintain an optimum level of liquidity to service the requirements that you might have from your client portfolios? That is a traditional way of treasury function and that is still very much um, a very important part of the treasury's operations. If you look at the last 20 years, the changes have been more on the customer focus side. If you look at uh, any treasury now, uh, you will have a corporate dealer or you will have a corporate uh, uh, focused uh, treasury guy who will be speaking to clients directly regarding a very specialized area uh, in relation to that client's own market risk that they might or risk that they might be carrying on their book. The biggest value addition any treasury will give a bank is the focus towards the external sector and understanding what is happening outside of the walls of the bank itself. You know, what, what are the driving forces out there that will influence risk or the current balance sheet that you're running or the current uh, risk that you're running? What are the influences that are there? And how should we position ourselves for that on one side? And uh, Treasury will also have the tools to manage that uh, based on a view that they have. We are fortunate that we have a diverse client base. That gives us the opportunity to actually offer uh, various products uh, to our clients uh, while leveraging up our own strengths. Uh, this could be strengths that we have from a funding perspective. Uh, this could be strengths we have from a risk management perspective. This could be uh, offering products to clients that give them a better yield or, or, and a return on their investments. Um, it could be uh, advising clients and uh, providing them with the know-how of the market and the pulse of the market is. And it could be making sure that we are there to support them through tough times, uh, especially when there are liquidity crunches in the market and there, there are very, very difficult uh, you know, conditions to work with. Uh, as an emerging market country and as a, as a country that has uh, uh, various challenges, I think we need to be close to our clients. Uh, and those two clients, not only from a corporate banking and a relationship manager, from a lending perspective or you know, retail perspective or whatever you call that, but also from a market perspective. So that closeness comes from having a very closely knit team that can speak to each other and ensure that you have a uh, collaborative approach towards your client from every aspect. Uh, looking at every part of the business that is impacted by. And that synergy does happen within uh, MPV. And I think markets is a very much part of that uh, conversation. Uh, and we are able to give a client a, a very much uh, packaged uh, product or package offering uh, with one voice. Uh, and I think that's a big advantage to have. Uh, we have a diverse uh, array of products from our fixed income uh, offering to our FX offerings to our money market uh, product offerings um, and uh, wealth management as well. Although wealth management, we are looking to go further. Currently, we have a wealth management proposition on offer as well. We are looking to expand that and we are looking to expand into that product suite as well. What we have realized is that there is uh, opportunity uh, for, and there is numerous requests that are being made from our wealth management clients for something different. Uh, something that is sort of, uh, maybe if you look at the last few years, uh, with the low, low interest rate in the environment we had, uh, there are requests to structure uh, products that you give you a higher yield pickup, for example. And that is something that we are definitely focusing on. Um, there are clients outside of their own dollar rupee risk. There are clients who have risk in third currencies. Maybe it's because of their payments for their children's education overseas, or you know, it could be 
various other uh, reasons where they need funding and they have accounts with dollars in it, uh, how can they actually manage that risk on the exchange rate? So we are looking at the management product for that to provide that, um, provide that cover as well. NTB, I think, like I said, is, is a unique place because uh, we are well known in the market, uh, known for our innovation, known for our ability to move fast, and known for our ability to actually uh, seize the moment and do the best that we can from that moment. And I think that's a huge advantage we have.